G. So we're G. We're training Cairo, our junior stallion. He's almost three. He'll be three this spring here. Um, we've had him in harness a little bit. G. Um, just set on him. Yep. Um, this is the first time he's ever been actually driven, ground driven, not hitched to anything. Um, he's doing really good. A little hesitant about things, but I'd rather him be hesitant as opposed to bolting. So he's doing really good. He's not afraid of much. Um, again, he's just, you know, super, super green. But I'm really proud of the way he's doing um, and the way he's handling me being behind him. Every once in a while I need to walk up beside him and, you know, lead him a little bit to get him to go forward past something. But in general, gee, gee, good, ha, huh. ha, huh. in general he's doing really good. Oh, there's a truck coming. Uh, I'm gonna go. Hope we survived the truck. Um, just wanted to make sure, as this is his first time driving, first time seeing a truck from behind, that he didn't go crazy on me and he needs my hands free just in case, but he handled it really well. Um, yeah, so we've got a pretty warm week this week, pretty wet week this week, so I'm not in the woods. Um, so I figured I will try to spend some consistency with this little guy. Gee. Um. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Good. Ooh. Try to spend some consistency with this little guy um, to get him started. Now again, he's not even quite three yet, so we're not going to hitch him up too much. Um, I might get him in a cart, just like a wagon, or a, not even a wagon, a four cart, logging arch. Um, just to see how he does that way. Um, but I'm not gonna do any actual work work with him yet. Probably not till middle, summer, or fall. Um, we like to give them some time to mature. That's why we wait till they're three before we even do anything with them. Oh, oh. Um, but yeah, that's the process so far. Just give them some hours on them, up and down the road, through the trails of the woods. Ha, ah. ah. ha. But Breed is so level-headed, so calm. Ha! <laughs> Come on, sip. Hi guys, let's go. Snack time, let's go. Good, good, good boy, good, ha, ha, good, ha, good, cheek, 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 easy, easy. like to practice stopping them um, get that will built in from day one who good boy who um, good just reward him for you know doing what he's supposed to get him some time to think who yep don't ask him to do anything too long in the beginning here so he doesn't get excited and want to keep going and then get mad. Short stops in the beginning here. See how he does with some of this stuff up here. A little more scary trailers and I think there's dogs up here. Good. 
Yeah, good, good, who? Do you want to think about it? Take a look, see? Yeah, let them, let them see what's who, who, who. Wait till I tell them to go. Let them give them some time to think. Let's go. Yep. G, G. Good. Good boy. Ha, ha, ha. Good. Good boy. Good. Ha, ha. A little drunken, but that's okay for day one. This is the first time he's had a bit in his mouth. Ooh. Now, I'm just driving him from his halter, as you can see. Um, just because he doesn't know what a bit is. Um, I don't need to confuse him. He knows what a halter is. He knows what pressure on the halter does. So I'm putting a bit in his mouth just to let him get used to having a bit in his mouth. And then we're learning whoa and easy and walk and turn, gee and ha, without that. Um, and then when I do use it, he will already understand the vocal cues and the, you know, some of, some of what's going on. Ha, ha. Um, so it won't be completely new to him. Go G, G. So this is day three. We've got Ty out learning to drive. Um, we've got him hitched up to just a little motorcycle tire. Pretty much just for noise. We're not really looking to scare him or have him drag any weight. It's more just a noise thing. See him see something behind him, hear the thing against the ground. Every once in a while I'll step on it so it has weight on it. So it pulls on his collar a little bit. Um, it makes a different noise just to see how he does and get him used to different sounds and different things behind him. Um, G, G. doing really good. things where I really just wasn't really feeling like getting out today but it's kind of hot been doing chores all morning and just wasn't super feeling it but you know you still have to do it consistency with them so day three in a row make a difference
and he's doing really good. I'm glad I'm out here. It's just the whole, sometimes doing it can be harder than it actually is. Saying you're gonna do it is harder than it actually is. So I'm stepping on the tire to make it pull on a collar and make some weird noise. Doesn't love it, but he's respecting it well enough. You can see his ears go up, his head goes up. He's listening behind him.